Mama just had both of us. But by the end of today, she will be childless. So I'll kill you. I'll kill myself too. I know. I'm not worthy to call your sister. <laughs> I have sinned against God and against you. <laughs> wants to kill her sister. I, I, I was even looking so she, she doesn't want to open the door. Huh? Jesus Christ. Okay, uh, uh, I'm coming right away. Eh? Break out the door, break out the door now. <laughs> oh, 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 I can't break that door. That door is too strong. Oh, oh, let's see if you want to afford the whole building. Huh? Oh, oh, okay. God. for your weakness. 
Card. That means you don't sleep at all now. Eh? What kind of job is this? This is called slavery. Mobile to you. Slavery. You may leave this back work. Why don't you look for a job that will give you time to take care of your, your, your family? Eh? Uh, you need to look after your children. Like uh, um, careful do your, uh, teaching. Yes, teaching. If you go to the classroom, 8.30 in the morning, 1.30 hours ago, you can't go in the morning. You can't go in the morning. You can work. I'm not work at all. All these jobs you're talking about, the salary is only on a meeting. I go to Google and not call my mama. Eh? If not for this banking work, mama, check in here now. Who would have been taking care of a uh, crazy school fees? And all these good hospitals I take you to, mama. Check in here now. People of crazy. Because since you started working in that bank, eh? You've been taking care of us. Crazy school fees more, eh? Hey, I have forgotten I'm a widow. Oh, no, 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 Lizzie, I eat very well now. Look at me. I have put on so much weight. Now I go for work. Mm. That canvas that you bought for me, I'm going to go to the corner. Now, guys, I'm going to come to the corner. I'm going to come to the corner. I'm going to tell you also. But, Mama, there's something I want you to do for me. I want you to help me talk to Praise. You know her exams are finishing by Monday. Mm -hmm. eh? mm -hmm. Let her take the first bus and join me in the city by Tuesday morning. Eh? It will help me along with Mama. Oh, because no, because yeah, no. Oh, so only me will be here in the village. Nobody to help me, Mama. Because yeah, no. mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Because you are a good daughter, and she's your your sister too. Mm -hmm. And also because you have little little children, no. Oh. Eh? I will tell her. Thank you, Mama. Oh, your sister. Oh, thank you, Koku, Mama. Thank you very much. You know how to <laughs> You know how to obwem. Man, I so bad. Before you go, oh, if you me how, I pounded it myself. While I was pounding it, I was sweating, sweating. Even some of the sweat was entering inside it, which will make it tasty. Hey, Mama, with all for Mama, how shape, Mama? Grab a shape. You be say when you get to the city, you look for shape. Okay, now. Check out my name, Major. Hi! Hold the boom. Fee, fee. Hey! I'm not going anywhere. I will not go. How can you talk like that? How can you even talk like that? Is this not your big sister that we are talking about here? Somebody that has been taking good care of us. Eh? Everything we eat in this house is the one that bought it. From milk to sugar. You went to secondary school. She's the one that paid your fees. This is the time to pay her back. Hey now, she, she trained me to the secondary school. Fine, let her finish what she's doing now. Let her finish it. When I get to the university, finish. I'll get a good job. Then I will pay her back. I'll pay her back. I will even take care of you. Get a better job and take care of you even more than her. I'll be, me, I will not go. I will not go. I cannot go and be, be a house help for anybody in the city. I'm okay with my village. I'm not going. Look at you. How will she pay for you to go to university when you cannot show appreciation for the little one? She has done for you. You are going to that city. You get job for Chechen and Yaka. You even now why? All this one you are talking here, I'm not listening. You must go and help your sister in a Chechen university. Can you talk? You can't become more than a pastor. If you hear Kuba, oh, oh, good university. Mama, I'm not going. I'm not going. You will see now. In this house, two of us, we will see. Be a white page upon me, shop on a villager. Nonsense. Mama, you must see how you you mean Chechen and Yaka. If you are now born in a village, next to my young boy, stand there with this. Go to the township and help and let us see if we will see a better man. Sorry, mommy. I'm so sorry for coming 
No need to be. I'm already used to it. No. I've spoken to Mama. And uh, she promised me she'll talk to Chris. So when we get tomorrow morning, she'll be here, okay? It's okay. At least a uh, relation is better than a total stranger. Yeah, you're right. And my children will also be safe in their aunt's hands. Exactly. Dressed yet, Mama? I don't understand. Dress for what? Ha! Is it not today that you're supposed to go to the city to work, to go and help your sister? In that dream, dress for what? Hey, Mama. <laughs> so you thought I was joking? I told you I'm not going. I will not go, Mama. I will not. I wasn't joking when I said that. So you want me to automatically leave my computer lesson and go to the city to do what? To help her as what? As house help? Mama, I will not. I'm not joking. I will not. She should employ somebody, not me. I won't. Oh. So you want to stay in the village and be going for who is not computerless? Bless, bless. Who is paying for the computer school? Eh? You're busy moving from one man's house to the other. You see, okay, okay. You just bought a car or car for zero zero. You mama bought a car for a car for zero the shot. You tip a bought a car for a car for zero the shot. You tip a bought a car. Eh? What kind of, of a human being are you? Instead of you to go to the city and help your sister that paid your, 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 your school fees and is not paying for that same computer, you're saying you will not go. Hey, Mama, you want me to go to the You see all this one you're saying, you're on your own. It will not change anything. I will not go. I will not, Mama. I'm all for lessons. Ma, welcome. Antonio, how are you? Did she come? No, no, ma. I didn't see anybody today. Come Tanya told me she didn't come. I got back and I didn't meet anybody. So I made some quick cereal for them. I'm so, so sorry, darling. Mama gave me assurance that she was going to be here. They're also my kids. It's my responsibility to take care of them. Oh, no, no, no. If I'm too busy and too occupied to do these things, I, I think I should provide an option. Not let my husband do house chores. Whatever. I'm sorry, I'll, I'll, I'll take care of it, please. I promise. Network, I did better. 
Eh, eh, Ugo? How are you? I am not fine, Mama. I am not just fine, Mama. Why didn't I meet friends when I got back to this house? Tell me why, Mama. Ugo, I work me. I told her. I begged her. I told her to start going to the city. Oh, she says she does not want to come to the city. Who wants to meet her, Mama? No, 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 Mama. Please, please. You just have to talk to Praise. Because if I come back from work tomorrow and I don't meet her in this house, First of all, I'm going to employ a house help and you because you as well not expect anything from me. Because I will use the money I spend in your own weekly basis and pay the house help. And as for Prez's university career, she should find someone who will take care of her and sponsor her. Please, Mama. Chimo, you don't have to be too, too rough with your, with your mother. Eh, no. Wait, wait. Late. I had to join my friend in their house. This one, this one you're, you're, you're asking. Am I doing anything for you in this house? Are you doing anything for me? Are you doing, any, are you, are you doing anything for me in this house? You don't want to get with this yes. You must stay with your yes. Hey, look at you. Better go in there, pick up your phone and call your sister and tell her you will see her first thing tomorrow morning. Kim Akoy. Nonsense. Get out of here. No? Did she say anything? Did she? You're asking me. You're asking me. You're asking me. You're asking me, You're asking me stupid questions. I told you I would come in. Yes, dear. All right. My eyes be lit. Thank you. You're the journey. It was okay, Uncle. Ah, oh, good. Mm. Welcome to our home. Thank you. Papa, bring her back. Let's go inside. Look at this This is where you will keep your bag for now. This is the room you will stay. 
you might have to change room later, but for now this is where you'll stay. Over there is a toilet and a bathroom. You can go in and freshen up. I'll be in my room. Okay. Make Thank yourself you. comfortable. Okay, Uncle. Thank you, Uncle. You're welcome. What do you want to eat? I want to eat rice. Why? Because I ate noodles at school today. I want to eat rice. Your mom is not around. When she comes back, she'll prepare rice for you. For now, take noodles. I want to eat rice. Eat noodles now? No. To eat rice. I'll spank you! No, Oko. You don't, you don't have to shout at her like that. It won't help matters. Auntie will prepare rice for you, okay? Now smile for Auntie. Good girl. Now let's go to the kitchen so you help me. So that you wear pants. I love my mommy, she loves me too. So, Princess, what did you learn in school today? I learned state and capital school. Abia, Maya, the mama, Yola, a quiet It's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. You don't need to sing white like eating, okay? So, you don't get choked. Whoa. I can see Junior is asleep already. Yeah, she's sleeping already. Finally. Okay, take it upstairs. Okay. Uh. Uncle, careful to stay. Okay. Oh, you. You're hungry. Oh, okay. believe that the transactions could not tally. We had to start all over again, only to find out that one stupid new employee committed a blunder in her records. I think we were happy to sort everything out. It's okay. Oh my goodness, Fiat, were you able to eat something? I'm sorry I made you go to bed on empty stomach again. No, no, I did it. I, your sister made a very delicious meal, so I had a wonderful dinner. Really? And the kids? They did too. Perfect. Let me just go and freshen up so I can have my Prince. Good morning, Dee. How are you? Fine, thank I hope you. I hope you slept okay. Yes, I did. Please, I have an early morning meeting this morning, okay? Take care of the kids, prepare them for school, and put something in their lunchbox, alright? Their father will take them to school later. How is Mama? She's fine. We'll talk about that later. Have a good day. I 
said it. I said it. She wants to tell me to a house help. If, if, if I was in the village, I'm very sure by now I would still be sleeping. How many days will I do at a time? Lodge boss, take them to school. Please, me, I'm still sleeping. I'm not going anywhere. Uncle, good morning. Good morning, praise. How was your night? It was fine, thank you. Okay. Uncle, breakfast is served. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay, um, let it be for now. Let me go prepare Junior and Princess for school. No, 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 Uncle, you don't have to do that. I've done that already. So, I'll just get them down. They are ready for school? Yeah. yeah. Interesting. <laughs> of the children. Can you believe by the time I'm back from work, my children are already in bed, dinner served. By the time I wake up in the morning, my kids are already in their uniforms. You can't believe it. Hey, <laughs> hey, my envy you. Hey, you see how good the help of a younger sister could be? But you know you can always employ a house help who can help you out. No, 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 no. Not after the last experience. My husband won't even hear it. No, <laughs> I won't try that, but that's continuous suffering. <laughs> My dear, as you can see, we don't belong in the same league. Hmm. Very soon, your star will get admission to university, and you will go back to square one. By the time that happens, another solution will start in there, so don't worry. <laughs> Good morning. Today is Saturday, right? I know. My sister said I should come and pick up your dirty clothes. Oh. Where's the sister? She's downstairs. Okay. Uncle, please, what would you like to eat? Ask your sister. I've already done that. She said I should require from you. Really? Interesting. I'm not playing my role. Oh, yes! Why would you ask her to come check my dirty clothes and ask me what I would eat? Is that not supposed to be your duty as a wife? Daniel! Don't Daniel me! You go to work every day, Monday to Friday. You don't care how we fare, you don't know how the kids survive. And on a Saturday, you still don't want to do anything. What kind of line is that? I sent her upstairs because I was busy down here. But yeah. not busy, you were just plain lazy. Please, Daniel, you met me as a banker and you married me as a banker. So you're going to. Oh, cut to... that crap! That banking crap! I know a lot of bankers who go to work every day, but they still manage to combine home affairs with that of work. But you, before Prince came into this house, I almost turned your house boy. You are blunt, lazy. That is it.
I mean, he has never complained before. <laughs> but you know men are like that. Once they see another woman better than their wife, they will. Another woman? No, no, no. no. Chris is my younger sister. I paid her school fees up to this moment. What's wrong with her coming out to help me with house chores? Not her sister's book. I understand, babe. But see, you have to take it easy with your husband. Even if he wrecks down the entire building, just be at the receiving end. It will help you a lot. And you know, little things like this can really bring a lot of problems to the world. So please take it easy with you. Things changed. When Daniel stopped complaining, and accepted things the way he saw them. I'm going to put on That was the beginning of our storm. Otherwise, one thing leads to another. Try to stop. 
Combine two words like la copita la vo la pokwa. Who is that? There's a phone. What do you know that? And I'll tell them it means that is my computer. Let nobody get near there. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you know what happened, Uncle? What happened? One day, one man from Ivy Coast came to the class. Um, he speaks French, so they said they should come and call me. That I'm the only one that understands French very well. That should come and translate whatever he says, Uncle. Hmm, if you see me wrong, <laughs> I run away. <will. laughs> Why are you running? You should have taken this place now. Am I crazy? Uh, uh, I used to grab him. As I saw him, I peeked. <laughs> I ran away. Like, hey, yeah. Why did you stay? Okay, I can't stay now. <laughs> you should have stayed back now. I'm so sick. I'm so sick. I'm so sick. Wait. I'm sick. Oh. Rock call. And what's the laughter all about? We're just chatting. Honey, you're back. <laughs> Yes, I am. Okay, I'll be in my room. No, no, finish your story now. I'll take it later. It's my own welfare. Yes, they're in their room. Good night. Okay, good night. Good night, French woman. <laughs> this is your sister, you did not kiss. <laughs> la computa, la bebu. <laughs> Honey, please let me take you to the hospital, okay? You've been like this for the past three days. Uh, please. We, we, we can't go out now. I won't risk you going out at this time of the night. It's almost 1 a.m. I know. I can call the doctor on the phone because he lives very close to the hospital. Please. Let's leave it till morning, please. No, no, no. no. I'm not comfortable seeing you like this, please. Just get up and change your clothes. Let's go to the hospital. Let's leave it tomorrow. Mm -mm. No, 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 please. Oh. Try. Just try and get up. Please, okay? So you can dress up. Try. Try, okay? Try, darling. Try, please. Goodness. Sorry, sorry, you'll be fine, okay? husband has been admitted in the hospital. The doctor said he has acute typhoid. Please, prepare these children for school. Put something in their lunchbox and for their breakfast, okay? Okay. 
Meanwhile, I've arranged for a cabman who will take them to school and let her take you to the hospital, okay? So also prepare something for my husband. Is that okay? Okay. Um, sorry about uncle. It's okay. Did you get what I told you? Yes, I got everything. Okay, okay. I, I have to rush now. I'm late for work. Attend your computer classes. I know I can always go there some other time, but you need my company now. I want to stay with you. You're such a wonderful person. You're an angel. Thank you. I love you, Chris. Daddy, 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 daddy. My boy, how are you doing? Daddy, we are fine. Daddy, when are you going to come back? I'm coming home tomorrow. I want to stay here with you. No, you can't stay in the hospital. You have to go home with Auntie Pris. No, I want to stay here with you. Princess, we shall come back, okay? But first you have to go home, change your uniform, get dinner for Daddy. Then we'll come back to see Daddy, okay? Okay. That's my girl, alright? You go home, get refreshed, then Finish it, okay? Okay. No, don't, don't worry about the clothes. I'm fine now. No, 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 no. The doctor say you have to finish it. But I'm okay now. No, you have to. Here. Please.
Ini kamu oke. Ini, you know I have to go to work very early tomorrow morning. Okay. Let's go rest, okay? Good. This has to stop. He is my sister's husband. What is happening to us? To me? No. No. It has to stop. It has to stop. I wonder why and how you prepare the village life your city life. Tell me, what is catching your fancy in the village, Grace? <laughs> Maybe she has a boyfriend there. <laughs> I think you're right, Lover. One rascal has been restless since she left. You never can tell, you know. You girls will not understand. Then make us understand, Grace. It's true that it's not been long we met each other, but at the stands now, we are the only friends you have here in the city. So we should be the shoulder you lean on. Anytime there's a need for us, tell us what the problem is, and we might have a solution for it. But we may be of help. You can't tell. This is beyond you girls. It's a hopeless emotional situation. Praise. No matter how complex the situation or the problem may be, we are young girls like you. We might have one or two things to tell you, you know. So let us understand. Tell us your problem. Like I said, you can't help. I said it's a complex emotional situation. And that's why I want to go to the village. If you can't help, then why am I running to the village? Just forget it, okay? Forget it. I should be done. Listen to my mom, how she thinks that this is my sister. I think I have to avert it now that it's been time. I have to go back to the village. What, what, what are you talking about? What? I don't understand. Praise. Stop speaking to us in videos, please. You don't understand. My sister's husband and I were getting fond of each other. More than required. Is there anything wrong with that? Like I said, you don't understand, do you? 
Of course I don't. Okay. Let me tell you. My sister's husband and I, we are getting... We are getting emotionally attached to each other. More than mere sisters in love thing. And the problem is, I don't trust myself anymore. I don't trust myself anymore. If he eventually comes to me, I don't think I can resist him. I think I'm calling you. Now you see what I mean. You understand what I'm trying to say. But you can actually stop it if you want to. You think so? Yeah. How? By telling your sister. <laughs> no, 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 I don't want you to go back to the village. There could be other solutions to your problem that does not include going back to the You don't have to go back to the village. There's no reason. What other solutions? Can you tell me what other solution? Just tell me one and I will do that. But not telling my sister because I will not tell her. She will kill me. Her husband. Do you know what that... Please, 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 please. Say something else, please. No, but don't make me regret for, for telling you girls these things. Please, I beg. How can you say that? It's Bitten. okay, it's okay. Nobody's going to kill you. Oh. Just tell your sister. I will not tell my sister. Thank you for your advice, but I have to go. I have no option. I'll miss you, girls. Yes. You, you, you do, Prince. You do. You do okay. I'll miss you, girls. You, you talk to your sister and she will understand. And then she You're can not talk to you. Do not understand. I can't. You have to. Try something. I never meant to. I never meant to cause you pain I never meant to bring a happy home I know how much you blame me I'm sorry, forgive me Remember one thing You know what? Indeed, Praise is in trouble if she can't handle that. What will you do if you wear in her shoes? You know, that's a big question. I don't know if they are both in love with each other. It's left to her to know if she's going to give up her joy and happiness for her sister. You still have not answered my question. What do you want me to say? That I'm, I should keep on hiding my feelings and nurture it till it's fully grown and matured. Is that what you want to hear? Maybe that is what I would do if I were in her shoe. You know what? Praise is different. And she has a proper home training. She won't do that. She can't do that to her own sister. Fine. Always leads to another. I never really planned it. One thing leads to another. Try to stop. You controller and the general manager. As long as you might be able to fight on the back end of the sex. Nothing can stand my way. I'm already there. What about if your husband stop you from going for this three months training program in South Africa? What would you do? <laughs> my husband can't stop me. He can't. Why? Why are you sounding as if you are too certain? <laughs> because even before he married me, he knew my passion. He knew my ambitions. And he knows that nothing can successfully stand between me and my career. I just can't. I just hope my husband will allow me to go for that three months training. I just pray he does. <laughs> With the way you're sounding, my dear, it means your promotion is in the hands of your husband. I mean, you know it's after the, the, the training that you'll be promoted. See, if my husband sees a way of stopping me from this banking job, he will. I hear talking about promotion. <laughs> you know, I need to be separate words, so it's not my. Speak up, say 
something. What's the problem? Nothing. Forget it. No. No. You have to tell me what the problem is and don't lie to me before I lose it on you right now. I wanted to tell you that I want to go back to the village. Why? I don't want to stay in your house anymore. I want to go. You're running away from house chores, right? You want to go back to the village, right? What you want to do is follow all those riffraffs and street boys. That is it, right, Praise? Huh? You want me to spend my hand and money on you? Every time you ask me to buy you clothes, books and everything. But you cannot help me when I need you, Praise. Let me tell you something. I don't want to hear this nonsense in this house again. Do you hear me? I don't want to just hear it again. You want to leave me and go? You want to leave us and go? Go where? Uncle, it's not what you think. I just can't help it, baby. Can't you see your love is driving me crazy? I don't want to stay anymore. Why are you doing this to me? You want me to go back to the kind of life I was living miserably? Uncle, please. Please. I don't want to cause problems between you and my sister. Please, please. Jesus! Oh. Is that? No, she, 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 she's gone to bed. She's gone to bed and she thinks I'm in bed too. What? Yes. You can't believe it, Agnes. What? My sister wants to leave me now of all times. She said she wants to go back to the village, that she's tired of staying with us. Can you imagine? Strange. So what would you do now? I want her about that nonsense. I, I believe she'll never talk about it again. Mm. Now that you're planning for that training trip to South Africa. Devil is at work, you know. No devil can stop me. Even if she insists on going back to the village, I will let her go. Nothing will stop from going to that train in South Africa. Instead, I will employ the service of a housemaid. Huh? Hmm? A maid? Huh? Men with all the scandals going on in Africa about housemates, rough handling and maltreating the children when their parents are not at home. No, I wouldn't advise that. I wouldn't do that myself. Instead, I will cancel the trip. Cancel the trip? <laughs> we both have our priorities, you know. I'm not even sure my husband will allow me to go for that trip. Like you rightly said, we both live in two separate worlds. That wish I couldn't tell. What's the reason of wanting? To go back to the village. And you're even with your big bag. Natanya, will you leave the way? 
leave the way and stop asking me questions. Please. Since you came into this house, everything has been moving well. Even the kids love you. Why do you want to go back to the village? Nathaniel, please don't remind me of things I don't want to know, please. Nathaniel, please. Okay, don't okay, bring okay, your... okay, 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 okay. Afternoon, be good. When you did not tell me that you were coming, okay? Is, is there a problem? No, there's no problem. What happened? Mama, can I at least go into the house fresh? You know, I'll tell you everything you want to hear. Please, Mama. Tell you, what? you want to go into the house freshen up? Why my heart is on suspension? No, let me check it. Freshen up. You don't want to tell me what happened, Mama. Be cool, no. Please, can I go in and change, freshen up? Mama, the journey was very hectic. Please, I'm tired. I'll tell you everything later, please. But now, let me go and freshen up, please. Hey! Shimo. Shimo, Buemo. Eh? What is it? We've been sitting down here for how long and you've not told me exactly what the problem is. Can you fit my Kianata? What is it? Explain to me. Let me understand. Biko. Mama, what else do you want me to say? What else do you want me to say, Mama? I'm no longer a kid. Okay. I know what is right and what is wrong. And I said I'm tired. I'm tired of that house, Mama. I'm tired of everything. Sister Oguna, her husband, the kids, everybody is not safe for us, Mama. Mama, I don't want trouble. Please, trouble. just let me be, Mama. Let me be trouble. Trouble, trouble. That's all you will say. You don't want trouble. Tell me what the trouble is, Kamalun. Are they beating you? Feneti Ife? If you don't tell me, I will not know what the problem is. Mama, I don't want trouble from Sister Oguna. Her husband. The kids. Everybody. Mama, please. Please. Just. Forget about it. Just let me be. Please, Mama. I'm tired. I'm tired. Audio Kamma. Audio Kamma. It's not good. This is your sister that we are talking about here. She, she, she goes to work in the midnight, comes back again in the midnight, no time to rest. Just for you to go there and look after the children in Oleba and I got trouble. Okay, I've said my own. No. If you like, you help her. If you don't like, you can't was Ali. Remember no one may be. Thank you. 
Who is your sister? Who is your sister, a prince? So you have the mind. You have the mind, a prince. Sister, it's not what you think. What is it? Tell me what is it? Huh? Eh? Tell me. Mama. No. Eh? Mama. So this girl came back to this house and you allowed her to stay in this house, Mama. Umba, when she came back, she told me that there was trouble. Everywhere trouble, trouble. Get her my mess. Trouble. What trouble, Mama? Ask her. Look at her here. Let her tell us what the trouble is. Tell her. You mean you people did not quarrel? Ah ah. Mama, look at her here now. We did not quarrel. Please. Mama. What happened? I. I don't want to stay. I don't want to stay. Mama, have you seen it? She's running away from housework, Mama. It's a lie, Mama. Ask her now, Mama. I'm the one doing the whole housework. I don't just want to stay. I don't want to stay. Why should I run away from housework? Why? <laughs> The only thing you know how to do, to do is to rub lipstick. He taught Angela to tell eyeshadow, tell you everything terrible. He he look wig, swag trousers. You mean me? Move moving on the highway. That's the only thing you know how to do. He will put his own one one up here. Now I can't check that, check that, check that, check that. Eh? Before I close my eyes and open it, eh? You better get into the house, pack your bags, and let's get back to the city. Hmm. Before your sister closes the eye and opens. Move on, move on. I I'm waiting, my friend. I don't want to stay. I don't want to stay. Look at her. Because I can open that day, I'm closing the eyes. How come I can my upkeep my, 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 my money? Because if you don't listen, she will not supply the milk and sugar. We didn't see praise in our center today, so we came to check if she's inside, if she's okay. She's fine, she's fine. Uh, can you help us call her and tell her that Joy and Lovet are at the gate waiting for her? Sorry, 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 I can't call her. No. I can't call her. No. What do you mean you can't call her? Are you sure she's inside at all? She's inside. Hey, call her and tell her that Joy and Lovet are at the gate waiting Is that too big for you to do? It's just better go. I can't call her now, please. Biao boy, are you okay? Call her, tell her that we are both waiting for her outside. Please don't call me, boy. Point of correction. My name is Nathaniel. Can you? Can you just go now? I can't call Hannah. Thank you. That trip to South Africa. Was an unfortunate. I'm the pit of hell. I'm sorry, forgive me. To me, no. To steal our love. I'm born. Leads to another. Try to stop temptation, but I went deeper and deeper. Because one thing always leads to another. We should go to the first. One thing leads to another. Try to stop my feelings, but I went deeper and deeper. Cause one thing always leads to another. If only you don't want me to go back to the village. Leads to another. Try to stop temptation, but I went deeper and deeper. Honey, why is your face like that? Come on, cheer up. It's just for three months, and besides, our work all good. Please. Are you sad? Yes, I am. Okay, let's go. 
Prince, please take care of the house for me. Take care of the kids as usual. Okay? And take care of my husband as well. Sister, I will. I'll miss you. I'll miss you too. <laughs> Prince, please take care of the house. I'll drop off at the airport and go to the office from there. Okay, Uncle. I will. You said you'd be leaving for the office from there. Yes, I, I forgot something. What? Let's go inside. Inside? Let's go inside. Free to do what? Free to love each other. Do this. I can't do this to my sister, please. Please stop saying this. She's gone. We have the whole house to ourselves now. Please. Please wait. Stop. Oh, stop, please. No, no, no. Please don't do this to me. Please, I beg you, God's sake, please. What I feel for you now is so deep. It's something beyond my control. You can't do this to me, please. She's my sister. I can't. Please. Praise, please open the door for me, please. Praise! No! Go to work! How can you do this to me? You know I've come to fall in love with you. I've fallen completely in love with you. I need to see you. Open the door for me, please! Daniel! Why are you doing this to me? Why are you torturing me? Why are you tormenting me? I'm your wife, sister! I know, I know that! I made a mistake marrying her. I want to correct that mistake now, please! Please don't leave me like this. Just open the door. I'm begging you. Just open. I want to talk to you. I want to see you. Go away. Go away! Leave me alone! Go! Go! Leave me alone! Okay, okay, okay. I'm going. Some of my friends tell me in school that it's more than 
takes him out always. But my mother don't do that. Princess, do you know why Santo's mother has time for them? Mm. It's because Santo's mother is a teacher. And your mother is a banker. Teacher have time for themselves. They go to work in the morning and close by 12 in the afternoon. Same time we close from school. But bankers, they work from morning till night. Okay? So don't compare yourself with Santo again. Okay? But Auntie Prince, will you be a banker? No, I will not. You know why? No. Because I would love to be a teacher. Because I want to have time to take care of you. I'll go to work in the morning, come back in the afternoon, bring you back from school. So I'll have time to play with you, feed you and take care of you. My mother is a banker. Yes, sweetheart, your mother is a banker. Now, open up, open up. Good boy. My mother will come back tomorrow, right? Mm -mm. Your mommy is not coming back tomorrow. Your mommy will come back next month. But I'm here for you now. But Auntie Chris, will you leave us? I won't leave you. I'll be here for you both. Are they asleep now? Yes, they are asleep. Thank you very much, please. I, I don't know how to thank you. <laughs> Uncle, you don't have to thank me. I owe my sister this. She contributed a lot to my upkeep and well-being. I'll be in my room now. Good night. Not even a hug.
the love so good Give me more, give me more, give me more Ooh, ah, it feels so good Can it be wrong when it feels so right? Ooh, ah, the love so good Give me more, give me more, give me more Ooh, ah, it feels so good Can it be wrong when it feels so right? Ooh, ah, the love so good Give me more Computer class payment. They are beginning to disturb me. On your way to your computer class, the branch of my office, I don't have cash on me. Where are my kids? They are outside, looking for you. Yeah, who is it coming? Have I not given you the money you asked for? Yes, you have. What are you still waiting for? I'm sorry. I'm going. Stop my feelings, but I went deeper and deeper. 
doing this to me. You no longer have time for me. You no longer eat my food. What have I done? Isn't that what you wanted? Tell me, please. We can still be close like we are without any sexual attachment. Please. You lie, Breeze. What are you talking about? Our emotions are involved here and you know it. Honey, I can't do this. You're my sister's husband. Stop talking about you being my wife's sister all the time. We're talking about love. Love just happens. We don't force it. What I feel for you is beyond understanding, it's beyond comprehension. I don't know. And I know you love me too, so why don't we just let it flow? And this love will not survive. It will not. It will survive. Can't I have a second wife? Don't I have a right to, to, to have a divorce? What are you talking about? Ever since you came into this house, all I've known is happiness and joy. Why oh, you want all of that to go away? Why? I go to bed each night wishing you were lying just beside me and then I wake up in the morning alone. Do you know how painful it is? Please, let's, let's allow this love to grow, I beg you. Please, don't do this to me. Let's be together. Our hearts yearn for each other. Let's give it a chance. I feel the same way too. Every night I keep asking myself, why you? My sister's husband. Why? It could be it could be any other man in the street. Why you? Why am I having these strong feelings for the wrong person? Our hearts can never be wrong. I know your heart yearns for me and mine yearns for you. Why don't we just let it happen, Grace? Listen to me. 
without you, I am nothing. I have, I'm just, just like that. I beg you, please. And I know you don't have to be scared about anything. We. The first day you stepped into this house, something in me jerked up in ecstasy. But I tried to suppress this because you were my wife's sister. But as hard as I tried to let go, the urge was stronger and stronger. I couldn't concentrate, thoughts of you filled my mind. The 
first day I held your hand at the hospital bed, I felt heaven. The first time I kissed you, I vowed never to let you go. You engulfed my total being. I urged and wanted you to be mine forever. And now here you are. In my arms right where you belong. I don't care any longer. I have to follow my heart. I may not know where this is leading us to. But one thing I know is that I'm in heaven right now. Praise is in kind of trouble. She's not even picking her calls and she didn't even come for lectures today. The praise I know won't miss lectures for one day. And now, he's saying that praise is in there but he will not call her out. Something is definitely not right. Something is definitely not right. Do you remember the story she told us about her ordeal with her sister's husband? Uh, yes, yes, yes. But, but she said that her sister has already taken control of the situation. Maybe she lied and she has given in for her sister's husband's demands. Nobody can, you can, you never can tell. I just wish it's okay. We pray on her. Why, why would she want her head? Wasn't she the one that started this all? That means Priest was right. Someone actually entered that room yesterday. Oh God, oh God. My marriage is about to come to an end. From the road, sir. The motor broke down. Oh. Break down. Yes, How? What happened to it? You refused to enter for gear. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Night is. I 
Trinity. taking us out this Saturday morning. Are we going to the beach? Soon to father takes them to the beach. Let's wait and see where daddy will take us to, okay? Honey? Okay. Alright, good. Look at my lovely kids looking crabbies. Do you know I can't remember when last someone took me out? Really? Yeah. For you, village girl. Eh. Okay, I'm not going in. I'm sorry now, you know I was joking. I'm not going. Okay, what do I do to make up for my sins? Too hot. Hot. <laughs> Look at it. Look at you, I know you like it. Mm. What daddy? <laughs> okay, All right, I get into the car. Get in, get in. Mm. No, I don't want her to spoil this mood. Honey, please take her calls. Boss, the call has stopped. I'm to bed. with work. I've been so busy. The workload lately is something else. No, not, not really. I... How can you say that? You, you know, I'm missing you very much. I'm so lonely on this big bed right now. There are 
good. They are fine. Oh, she's she's good. She's great. She's been taking good care of the kids and I. She's actually feeding us fat. Yeah, I'm here. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, that's that's great. Uh, thank God, finally I get to see you. I, I've missed you so much, you know. I will. I love you too. What is it? She's coming back soon. already. I, I didn't realize myself. <sighs> Can they not just extend?
nothing. There's no problem. Your wife that you've not seen for the past three months is lying beside you. And you can't even notice her. Why? I just told you now there is no problem. Okay? I am just having some symptoms like I told you earlier. I'm good. I, I thought you said you were going to see the doctor. Yeah, yeah, I, I actually went, but was not sit. I'll go back tomorrow. You left me here all alone in this cold night to be with her. Come, Danny. Come and finish what you started doing. I left her in the room, she's fast asleep. I, I couldn't sleep without you. Me too. I couldn't sleep all night. I miss you, Danny. I love you, Danny.
You're awake. Where are you coming from? I, I, um, I, I went to the children's room. You know, Princess has been having this nightmare for the past one week. She just jacks up and screams in the middle of the night. So I went to check up on her. How is she better? Oh, she's good. She's good. She's gone to bed. I guess mm -hmm. she was missing you and all of that. myself since I got back. You can't believe it. My husband is not happy to see me. He's not happy that I'm back. Are you saying he didn't touch you last night? For where? I was the one who even tried to do that. And he gave me some clumsy excuse. That's serious. My son Junior could not even embrace me when he saw me. Huh? They were like, why did you come back? You wouldn't have come back. Can you imagine that? God have mercy. I hope it's not what I'm thinking of. Are you thinking the same direction with me? Please, if that is what you're thinking. I suspected some foul movement last night. <laughs> <laughs> if this is true, if this is what I'm even imagining, I will kill somebody. I mean, I will devote that girl with my bare hands. I'm telling you the truth. I will kill her. See, babe, there is only one way to find out the truth. And you have to take that one way as fast as possible. Hey, hey, I didn't tell you girls. My sister bought me a lot of things from South Africa. Serious? Hmm. My own is that this top you're wearing now, eh? You will go in there and turn into something nice because I want this. It belongs to me. Look at this girl. If I give her this top, what will I, will I wear home now? That's your problem. Eh? You want me to go naked? Don't worry. I have one 
very beautiful one like this exactly like this but different is the color yellow it will suit you now you know you're dark i know go green you guys are not talking about giving out clothes i'm not left out here what about me <laughs> no, wait, don't worry, I have one very nice one for you, very sexy. Nice like serious? Yes, now. Ah, very sexy. I like want the sexy one. Ah, ah, you my first now. I can't have so seen that you can do yours now. Hello? Please, please meet me in my office right away. Now? Immediately, please, now. Okay. I'm coming right away. Who was that? My sister. She wants me to come to her office right away. Get something from us. Why come you back now? And tell her your friends are saying a very big welcome. And we're asking for our own South African goodies. Then I won't give you what I have for you girls again. No problem. Oh, 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 for you guys. Let me go and say bye. She's going to suspect us. Yeah, I think so too because she came into my room last night. I didn't even know when she entered. She did? Yes, she did. That must have been after I've gone back to my room. Maybe. So, what do we do now? I, I don't know. I, I think it's about time I told her the truth. She needs to know what's going on. I mean, she has to be ready to accept you as a co-wife, then she can go. That's my stand. Mm -hmm. Really, no, please, please. Not now, please. Then when? I'm tired of playing hide and seek in my own house. I'm too big for that. Really, please. Please. There are things we should consider here. There's a point we should consider here. She's my sister, remember? She gave me a better life. I can't possibly pay her with evil. No. Please, just hold on. I will tell you when to tell you, please. I don't have time! Danny, please. This is not what we should be discussing here. Please. What should we be discussing here? I'm leaving. When I get home, I'll call you. No, 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 please. Don't keep me on suspense. Don't. Huh? Don't keep me on suspense. Any movie without suspense is not what was she. Remember? That's your favorite line. But we're not making a movie here. We'll see. Fine, Dad. See you later. Okay. Your food, sister. It's in the kitchen. I'll eat later. Yeah. Bring your place it together. Yeah, bring yours. Hello? Good evening, sir. Oh, okay, sir. All right, sir. Right away. Honey, um, it's our regional manager. He just called me that we have a board meeting, all night board meeting, and it's very important. An all night board meeting. Yes. By this time. Yes. It really must be important for him to call you up for this. Yes. It's alright, you can go. Okay. Let me let me get ready. Thank you. 
I'm going out. Hmm? Keep your phone very close. I'll be back in one hour's time. Okay? If I call you, open the gate for me. I am not coming back with my car. Have you heard me? Yes, ma'am. If anybody asks you what I just told you, don't tell them anything. I hope you understand. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Open the gate. Praise. Praise. Has she gone? Yes, she's gone. I can't wait. Please. Please, wait, wait, wait. What? Wait, let me shower. I'll join you later. No, no, there's no time for that. Go! Oh, let me freshen up. I'll join you. Oh, okay. Please be fast with it, okay? Go, go, go. Don't waste time. Fast. the excitement on their faces when I told them I was going for an online board meeting. Are you serious? <laughs> I am very serious. <sighs> so why will a small girl like praise up to this kind of behavior? <laughs> I have no idea. But let me tell you, if this results to be true, I will become a mother by tomorrow because I'm going to kill her. I will kill her. Must be at it now. Yeah, I'll wait. Go and come back. God help me. Don't do anything stupid, okay?
Dead. Please, 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 please. Someone has not cried for the past 20 years. Are you thinking of a joke? Wait, no, stop. Let's go to my house. Let's have a home car. No, 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 no. No! One thing leads to another Tried to stop temptation but I went deeper and deeper Cause one thing always leads to another I never really planned it One thing leads to another Tried to stop my feelings but I went deeper and deeper Cause one thing always leads the meeting so so hectic I need to take a warm bath and rest oh, yeah, that's good. you're still going back to the office right do you expect me to no no I'm just uh, I'm to be sure Make sure you don't look 
for trouble, okay? Is 
survive this. Please forgive me, Lord. It was all my fault. I shouldn't have left my primary duty as a wife. I should have listened to my friend. Father, please, for my sake, for the sake of my mother, spare her life. Never will I leave my duties to anyone again. Because as I'm here, the banking work is going on in my office without me. I never really planned it. One thing leads to another. Try to stop my feelings, but I went deeper and deeper. Cause one thing always leads to another.
good man. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for, for everything I've put you through. I'm sorry for the kind of havoc I've wrecked in this house. I don't know what got into me. I, at some point, I, I began to see praise as the woman of the house. She was always around doing all the chores, taking care of me, and she became my soulmate at some point. I, I didn't realize what I was doing, I didn't realize how deep I had gotten. Now I know what I have done to you. I know the pain I have caused you and I beg you to forgive me, please. You don't have to be sorry. I'm the man. How could you be sorry? I'm the one who should be sorry. I left my primary assignment, which is you my children and my home. My ambition for my work took over me. I'm very, very sorry. Please forgive me. I have forgiven you. Please forgive me too. Another 